What is going on you guys? It is Murph here back with another X-Plane 11 on air company manager video here. This is episode number three. We're doing another full flight, or I guess we'll say full flight quote unquote, um, to where are we going to be going? We're going to be going to Edmonton, Alberta from my hometown, Fox Creek, Alberta. So we're going to our international airport here in, uh, um, in, in Edmonton, sorry, <clears throat> if I can speak. Let's go ahead and load up some fuel here we'll probably need about around 30 percent here let's go ahead and load the cargo here and then actually let's throw a little bit more fuel and just to be safe here throw about 20 gallons in and then we'll go ahead and confirm and go fly All right, now we're just loading up our gas and loading up our cargo here. We're going to C Y E G. Now he's gonna wait till everything's all loaded up. Alrighty, now that everything's all loaded up, we got our airport selected. We can go ahead and start tracking our flight simulator here. And then we should see all our green check marks. There we are. And we're connecting and we're good to go start our engines. Let's go ahead and turn this little page off for you guys. On air flight monitor started. And let's go ahead and start our aircraft. So. I have all the switch panels here down below here my aircraft are flying the Piper Warrior 2 here so let's go ahead I'm going to turn my battery switches on my alts my master switches and then um my actually hold on let me free end this is not making the sound I wanted to hold on here guys Turn on our battery. Fuel pump. Open fuel up. Now we'll go ahead and start them. No? Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. Oh, Alrighty, guys. We're back. Sorry about that. For some reason, my switch panel is not working, or some of the switches aren't working. My battery switch is not working, but my alt switch is there. You can see down here. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and turn our fuel pump on here, and then open up our throttle here, and that should be good. Go ahead and start the engine Your now. Your flight will be monitored until you land and shut there down the go. engines. Your flight will be monitored until you land and shut down the engines. Turn our avionics on. Our lights are all on. We're good to go there. And then let's go ahead and go ahead and start planning our flight here. So we'll go menu, we'll go ahead and clear flight plan, delete flight plan, enter. Then now we're we'll go select that, go down here. Now we're going to go YEG or CYEG, I guess. It's the tag for the airport. So C, uh, Y, oop, and then you go up. E and then G, and we can go ahead and get ready for takeoff here. There we are. Now we can go ahead and select enter, and then come up. Oh, wrong one, wrong way. Come up notch, and then I don't know menu, activate leg, and then we should have our pink line. There we are. Perfect. Now we can start <coughs> setting our autopilot, or anyway, set it. Move our heading there, so see this little orange or heading bug here. Go ahead and change that, and put that to the heading of the runway, which should be around here. Or we'll leave it there, and then we'll go ahead and set our vertical rate to 500 feet. And we'll take our parking brake off, and we'll go ahead and go. So let's. Sorry for the chair squeaking. But let's go ahead and take off, boys. So parking brake is off. Full throttle. And we're ready for takeoff. Keep it on the runway. Give us some right rudder. Okay. Looking for. Well, look around for 70 knots. 
We gotta use a lot of the runway here, boys. Oh, she is heavy. Okay, hitting 60, 60 knots. 70. And then we'll pull up now. Come on now. Oh, this is a sketchy takeoff, but we're up in the air. Airborne time log. I'm gonna go ahead. Oh, let's hold it up. Keep climbing. Let's wait till we're up in the air just a little bit to engage autopilot. Okay, heading is on. We'll go back to heading here. Just maintain, keep climbing here. Put the vertical sink there. Now we are good to go, boys. We are autopilot's all in control. We are up in the air. Ha ha ha. <laughs> So this is going to be probably another two hour flight guys so I'm going to do a little time lapse for you guys and probably go eat some lunch or I guess it's supper time now but let's go ahead sorry if it's a little loud right now but go ahead and get to the time lapse guys. Alrighty guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that little time lapse there. But we're probably about, I'd say 10, 15 miles away from the airport now, where we took off from. Um, we're at our cruising altitude here, we're cruising at 3,000 feet, going about 120 nautical miles. And we'll see you guys in a little bit more. guys and we are back here setting up for our approach here um, as you've seen previously in the last clip I did a little time lapse of uh, uh, our setting up our approach there sped it up um, should have some music in the background now um, but anyway guys I'm actually recording the voice for this clip probably about six hours after the actual footage because my friends came over and, and there's nothing I could do about it so you know I just recorded the footage and I got it out to you guys so here we go we're coming to land here the approach was kind of quick, very quick, because my friends showed up and I couldn't really have time to set my autopilot to adjust it to where I wanted to, so I take a very steep right turn as you've seen there in the time lapse, and then after that it was pretty much smooth sailing from there as we're coming in now. It was pretty much butter landing, guys. And then here we go, we're floating over the runway, going about 70 knots, still a little, a little fast, but it was a good landing. This is at the uh, Edmonton Internet International Airport here in um, Canada, Edmonton, Alberta, sorry. 
Landing time logged. Landed at Charlie Yankee Echo Golf, Edmonton INTL. Alrighty guys. Anyway guys, the last little clip here is just me taxing off and going to park. I'll go ahead and speed that footage up for you guys and play some music. But anyway guys, I'm going to end the voice over here. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more X-Plane videos. We'll see you all later. Peace out. Engine off time logged. End of flight. Registered in on air company.